The debate as to what this black thing next to me continues. Adam Astelane says pretty sure it's your bed. HT30 Navy says it's a bunk bed. James Matthews says it's a sex thing where a head goes in. <laughs> what the hell are you talking, man? <laughs> what the f- Me Yeri says you thought it was a flat screen TV and then it's a bed board, now it's a blackboard. Well, <sighs> some of you are close, some of you are way off. <laughs> And I'm still not telling you. <laughs> hey guys, it's your girl Peggy here. Today we're gonna eat pasta. Yeah, I think this is the first time we're eating pasta on the show, right? Well, anyway, just in case this is the first time we met, welcome to my channel. I do eating shows like this every week. So if you enjoy eating shows, please consider subscribing and hit the bell icon next to it to get notified every time I upload a video so you don't miss anything, right? Okay, so I got here six types of pasta from the Workbench Bistro, a restaurant in Singapore. I got the salted egg chicken pasta, the crab meat linguine, the smoked duck aglio olio. Is it aglio olio or aglio olio? How do you pronounce that? <laughs> anyway, here are some um, carbonara seafood pasta and mushroom pasta. Yeah, this restaurant seems to have a lot of good food on their menu. So if this is good, I may be eating from this same restaurant again in my next video. I don't know, we'll see. If you are watching this and you're in Singapore and you're interested in the Workbench Bistro, I will put more details of this restaurant in the description box below. As always, before we begin, big thank you to my Patreons. Thank you so much for your pledges. Thank you so much for feeding me. <laughs> I appreciate you. If you guys wish to support me on Patreon, the link is down below. Alright, let's start eating. Alright, I got my giant fork here. It's big, right? Is it too big though? I think it's mine. <laughs> okay, let me start with this one. The crab meat linguine, I believe. Ooh. Yeah, tastes very crab-ish. <laughs> this is the crab meat. You know what, this is really good. I think I'll eat from them again. I'm pretty sure I can finish today's meal. Well, that's what I always say in the beginning, but <laughs> we'll see. Yeah, look at that.
This is good. I'll give it a 7 out of 10. Okay, this one is the carbonara. You know what? This is really good. It's very creamy. I like creamy stuff. Ooh, look at that. It's really cheesy too. This one, 8.5 out of 10. I'm gonna try the chicken. Still crispy. Yeah, this is the drawing that I'm working on. It's Chester Bennington. I'm not done yet though. I still have the left side of his body. Yeah, these tattoos are really fun to draw. I will show you guys once it's done, okay? Okay, this one is the Smoke Duck Aglio Audio.
The smoked duck is pretty good. Just in case you guys are wondering, the spaghetti is still warm. I did my introduction in one take, which is rare. Usually I'll do it like three to four times. This one gets a 7 out of 10. It's good. Okay, what's next? I'll eat this one. Okay, this one is salted egg. Um, is it salted egg pasta? You can see the bits of salted egg. Yeah, it tastes like salted egg. Well, and it's also a little creamy. Wow, well, okay. It's quite nice actually. You know, salted egg seems to be like the trending thing right now. People are trying to come up with salted egg versions of everything, right? Like salted egg croissants. Salted egg burgers, salted egg fries.
This is really good. Still crispy. I was trying to look at the time, it's about 21 minutes. I think I'm doing pretty good. <laughs> okay, muscles. Wait, have I rate this yet? I'm gonna give it a 9 out of 10. Yeah, the salted egg pasta. Because it is really unique. I haven't tasted anything like that before, so... Extra points for creativity.
The squid is quite fresh. Is it squid? Yeah. Have you guys heard of the TV show, The Doctor Show? Doctor Show? Have you heard of it? I think it's a show where it's like a group of doctors discussing about health issues, I think. I'm not quite sure. I got an email from them. They were asking if they could use my new Clear Fire Noodles video in their show. It'd be funny though. You know, my butt took a hit for that video, the new Fire Noodles video. But it's got like 2 million views now, so I guess it was worth it. I actually fell sick after that video. Yeah, two days after the video, I got a fever. <laughs> yeah. Those noodles are evil, you know. Don't eat them. This one gets a um, 6.89 of 10. I mean, um, the ingredients are really fresh. It tastes really good. It tastes good, but it's also very normal. So, but it's fresh though. If you like seafood, you can go for that. And now it's a little spicy. Okay, finally we have mushroom pasta. Whew. What time is it? 30 minutes, okay.
It tastes very mushroomish. I'm sorry, my vocabulary is not very broad. It's also a little peppery. Wow, they're very generous with the mushrooms. The last mouthful is full of mushrooms. Okay, I'm done. Managed to finish everything today. Yay! Pasta is pretty easy to eat, you know. There's not a lot of meat. It doesn't fill me up quite as much, you know. If there's a lot of meat, like chicken and beef and things like that, then that would be really filling. But for pasta, it's pretty alright. Although I'm very full now, so... Oh yeah, I forgot to rate this. This mushroom pasta, I would give it a 7. If you like mushroom, you can go for this one. It's peppery, garlicky, and they give you a lot of mushrooms in it. So that's good if you like mushrooms. I may be eating from this same restaurant again in my next video. Um, I don't know, I'll go do some research and if I cannot find any other alternative, I may order from Workbench, Workbench Bistro again. Yeah, the name is quite hard to say it, right? Workbench Bistro. All right, thank you so much for joining me in today's pasta video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Yeah, um, this is my drawing. Um, if you guys want to see the completed work, you can follow me on Instagram. 
I'm not finished with this yet, but um, I will be posting this when I'm done on Instagram. Yeah, that's about it. Thank you so much for joining me. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and please subscribe if you haven't. I will see you all in my next video. Until then, take care and I love you. Bye-bye!